Bison Peak, what is up? Welcome back to Bison Peak TV. My name is Nick, and today is... I'm gonna stop doing the my name is Nick thing, I think. It's so dumb, you know my name is Nick. All right, so uh, today is what? The 26th, it is Friday. Happy Friday, y'all. Hopefully you are prepping up for a great weekend. Let's jump right in. Don't forget to stretch. Moving on. Seatbelts and DNRs. I'm not so worried about seatbelts right now. You all are doing a great job. So, I mean, I am always worried about it. Keep it up, but you all are doing a great job right now. So, awesome work. Um, DNRs, on the other hand, are still a thing. I think they're always gonna be a thing because you can't totally control the honesty of everybody. So that's gonna be one thing that's like a total, but for the most part, you have full control over how many packages you get delivered and delivered properly. So make sure you're reading customer notes and calling dispatch whenever you have questions. Even if you don't have questions, don't mark packages undeliverable unless, I'm picking up a pen, unless you, um, unless you uh, don't mark them undeliverable unless you call dispatch. Sorry, I got totally sidetracked just by picking up a pen. All right, so moving on. Yesterday, God, yesterday was good. Yesterday was really good, actually. Uh, I can't think of anybody specifically who was like just shining, but all of you did a great job yesterday. I think we only had a couple people go into the yellow or the red, and it was really only because we'd send you a courtesy rescue and it slows you down for a couple of minutes and then boom, you get caught right back up. But great job either way. Um, work tip for today. The snow's pretty much gone, but not everywhere. Obviously, like in my neighborhood, there's still snow and ice everywhere. So be really careful today when you're out there on the road, probably a little bit less than yesterday, but still be careful. But mostly when you're getting in and out of your vans and walking around outside, be super careful. Avoid those slip and falls. If you're paying attention and you're watching what you're doing, you can avoid 100% of those things. So be really careful out there. Uh, watch yourself on stairs. Don't run. Um, just be really careful about where you're putting your feet. Um, what else? Scan to verify. We get hit on this a lot, so we need to not get hit on that a lot. So do us a favor and make sure that you, as soon as you see scan, you open up your rabbit and you see scan packages or swipe to finish, you immediately hit scan packages. Even if you're at the yard, then when you get over to the station and you open up your rabbit device, it'll automatically be on your scanner. It's just a much better idea. So do that. Uh, sign violations are huge for a lot of you. Um, I keep screaming about this, not screaming, but singing about it here on this channel for sure. Um, and if you're watching it, awesome. But if you're not paying attention, you're gonna notice real soon because it's definitely going to screw up your score and put you under 900 and definitely affect your bonusing. So um, I recommend you stop at every stop sign for sure. Okay, so uh, no new programs coming up right now. Amazon's keeping things mellow for a second, but we are working on this right here, DSP of the quarter right now. So make sure that you are helping us by keeping your scores as perfect as possible so that we can just crush the competition. So keep that up. Um, delivery experience today, we're looking at 3,300 packages, 3,340 to be exact. It's a little bit more than yesterday and we have a couple routes less. So you will see some slightly heavier package counts, but not significantly, maybe an hour on everybody's route, but tops. Um, I do have some rescues today, so we're gonna get those of you with the highest package counts um, knocked out, we'll bring you right back to the yard and make sure that we take those packages off you, some of those packages off you to make sure that you go out kind of even with the rest of the pack. Um, but everybody, be ready to rescue. All right, um, scores this week, mentor. Everybody who drove yesterday was over 800, or, yep, over 800 except for one, at one who was under 800. So, you know who you are, actually. I don't think you're working today. But if you, you talked to me about it yesterday, so I appreciate that. We'll bring it back up. I'll make sure I work with you. But in the meantime, the rest of you focus very strongly on not getting under 800. Um, Netrodine scores. We're kind of dropping still, guys. It's not good. You all need to be paying a lot of attention to what you're doing in those vans. Don't forget, Mentor says it's 10 miles over is what they'll give you for the speed limit, but Netrodyne's only five. If you're doing more than five miles over the speed limit, Netrodyne's gonna ding you, and every one of those is gonna cost you. Um, so that stop signs, distracted driving, all of those things can really screw you up, but you're not paying attention, and now we're dropping like a point or two every day not good so right now our net average for the day yesterday was 935 down another point i have three of you below the 900 mark it's going to cost you your bonus guys you better get it up for the week average for the entire team we're looking at 961 it's still down two points but 
I mean, it's okay. But there's plenty of you guys who are out there who get perfect thousands. So that means that the rest of you are screwing up and not paying attention. So we know it's possible. You just got to stick to it and get it done. So uh, we're going to keep working with you guys on that and reminding you how to properly get that stu- get your scores up. Um, but if you're under 800 on Mentor or under 900 on Netrodyne, it's going to cost you money. And hopefully that hits you where it hurts because that will teach you to move forward and you won't want to lose that money again the following week. That's the only other thing I can hope because all I can do is talk to you about it like this. Can't get in the van with you and be like, hey, don't do that. So unfortunately, you're going to have to do some work, guys. So make sure you're paying attention to this stuff. Um, oh, today's secret word is hot sauce. <laughs> I don't know why. It's All right, cool. Um, again, watch your speeding five miles over do not do more than five miles over period uh stop signs three second stop at all of them one two three then go and following distance make sure you're three seconds behind the guy in front of you person in front of you vehicle in front of you got to keep it all pc around here um otherwise that's pretty much it guys it's going to be an awesome weekend i went ahead and bought a crap ton of snacks so the snack van will be fully stocked for the weekend um Reminder, Sheena's going out of town for the weekend. Any issues that you have should always be brought to me first anyway, but specifically this weekend because they're going out of town. Call me with anything or text me with anything that you need. Um, Obviously, if it's schedule related, I will work it out best I can. If I have to call Sheena, great, but I don't want 10 of you calling Sheena while she's away this weekend. So please make sure that you are directing all that stuff to me. Awesome. That's pretty much it. Guys, have a wonderful weekend. This has been Bison Peak TV. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.